Welcome back, CHS. We have missed you so much, and we're so excited to have you back for the fall of 2020. Today's video will go over what it'll be like a day in the life of a student here at Cohasset High School. We wish you all the best fall ever, and whether you're in person or remote, we'll be so excited to see you. All students who are being dropped off or picked up in the AM or PM, please do so in the rear back circle of the school. All students that are driving to school and park in the front lot will report directly through the main entrance doors of the high school. Please have your face mask on before you get out of your car with your mouth and nose covered and practice social distancing when entering the building. And this is what a typical classroom will look like. Desks will be three feet apart and students will have to wear their masks at all times. Before entering each class, please hand sanitize your hands. Attendance will be taken by the teacher in Aspen each class period. Our mask break protocol. You will have 10 minutes in between each class for a mask break outside in the courtyards, backfields, and if the weather is inclement, it will be in the cafeteria or the gymnasium. This is where you may take your masks off and stay six feet apart following social distancing. You are also allowed to eat and drink during these times. This is a great time for some face time. Our restroom procedures will look a little different than it has in the past. All students will follow the one student in and one student out of the restroom protocol. You will sign out of your classroom and then take a yellow post-it with your name on it. When you reach the bathroom, you will place the post-it in the basket beside the sign. This will notify other students that someone is presently in the bathroom. When you leave, you will take your post-it back with you and dispose of it in the trash. Our cafeteria procedures will definitely look different than last year. Our biggest goal and most important goal is to keep everyone safe at this time. One-way traffic is our main goal when entering the cafeteria. You will proceed to the very last door on the right-hand side of the CAF. When it is time to exit, we will ask that all students go out the back door and head towards the back circle entrance outside of the school and enter in by the gym. Hello, is Mrs. Collins here. I'm here to go over um, donning and doffing your mask. Donning is putting on, doffing is taking off. Okay, so first we're going to put on. If you can, you should always wash your hands first. So you take a quarter size drop of um, hand sanitizer, or if you can go to the sink, that works too. Wash your hands, make sure you get in between your fingers, your thumbs, and you rub until the hand sanitizer is dry, okay? So now that I've done that, I'm gonna grab my surgical mask, because these are the masks, if you forget your mask at home, these are the masks that you will be getting, I do believe. First you're going to do is take it on the uh, ends here and you're going to pull, okay, to kind of straighten out the pleats a little bit. Going to put it on your nose and press down and then take the ear loops and put them around your ear and pull the mask down, okay? If you wear glasses and your glasses are fogging, the best thing to do is to put your glasses over your mask. Okay, and that will decrease some of the fog. Your mask must cover your nose and your mouth at all times. If during the day your mask becomes soiled, you need to change it. Okay, uh, you can get your mask, extra mask from the main office, the nurse's office. I do believe the teachers will also have some in, on, in their classroom. Uh, so now after you've had your mask on for a while, say you sneeze, cough, but it's soiled in some way, shape, or form. So the mask itself is now considered dirty. So you don't want to put your hands on that. So when you remove the mask, you want to use your ear loops, okay? So just remove your ear loops, hold it like that, and drop it in the waste paper basket, and put your new mask on. If you have any questions, you can always come and see me. I'll be happy to do my donning and doffing again, okay? Thank you. The Cohasset Safety and Wellness Policy. We ask that you abide as caring and protective citizens of our school and community. Not only protect ourselves, but our staff and all those that we come in contact with. I ask that you say this to yourself or out loud.
By coming to Cohasset High School, I pledge the following statements. I will abide by the state expectations for social and physical distancing. I will abide by the regulations of wearing full facial covering over my mouth and nose when in school and public settings to protect all students and staff. I will abide the, by the guidance directives that the students and staff stay home from school if you are experiencing the symptoms related to COVID-19. And last, I will follow all quarantine regulations put forth by the Mass Department of Health in the Cohasset Health Department. Thank you. Can't wait to see you all.